Any video that you're making for YouTube needs to be very interactive because that is what is going to increase your retention rate and in turn it translates to lots of reach, lots of subscribers and lots of views and that is what all of us want, right? So based on popular demand, I had to go into deep research and after so many nights, I finally found a way that you can create 50 interactive YouTube shots in less than 10 minutes. So if you're looking to grow your YouTube channel or maybe you want to grow your TikTok account or your Instagram account, then this video is specially made for you. So please come closer and let's dive in. So to get started, let's go over to ChatGPT. That is what we're going to use for this first step. So the first step is to ask ChatGPT to give us 50 riddles. Don't worry, I'm going to tell you what to do with this. So now ChatGPT has written the riddles for us without the answers. So what we're going to do next is to simply copy, right click and then you click on copy and then you go over to spreadsheet. Your spreadsheet, it could be Microsoft spreadsheet or Google spreadsheet. So now you come over to your spreadsheet and paste the riddle that we copied from ChatGPT. You can either right click and paste or you use Control V. Anyone that you use is totally fine. So we're going to use Control V, and here you can see all 50 of them. So the next thing we're going to do is to rename this. So we're going to save it as Riddle Questions. Okay. So we have the Riddle Questions here. Then the next thing you're going to do is to come over here to File and scroll way down to download if you're using Google Spreadsheet. But if you're using Microsoft Spreadsheet, all you have to do is to save it as CSV file. But if you're using Google Documents, you're going to download it as a CSV file. So here, I'm going to click on download as CSV file. So now it has downloaded to my device. And the next thing we're going to do is to come over to Canva. So on Canva, you're going to click on create blank. So it's going to open a blank Instagram reel format. And then you go through the templates and pick the one that best suits your vibe. So for the purpose of this tutorial, I'm going to go ahead and use this. But you can take your time and search for something more amazing. And then if you don't like the video in the background, you can easily search for any video. You can come over to your elements and search for any video whatsoever. So you can search for riddles and come over to video and then you can pick any video here. So all you have to do is to pick any video and then drag it to the background and then you have something like this. So if this is something you want, it's totally fine. Just play around it and let your creativity run wild, okay? So now we have this and you can choose to change the color to whatever color that you want this looks amazing so here we're going to change this to whatever you want to name it so be creative with this like i said let your creativity run wild okay so we're going to go ahead and write riddle questions i can even come over to chat gpt and copy this number one just to test out things and see if things fit perfectly because you need to get everything to fit perfectly before you can move over to the next phase. So here I'm going to paste this to see if it's okay. And it's looking totally fine like this. Okay, it's looking fine. And we can increase the font just a little bit. So the next thing you can do to make this more creative is actually come over to elements and search for thinking, okay? thinking like someone that is thinking about something so this will increase the retention rate as well as their interaction on the video so we're going to pick just about anyone that tickles your fancy but i love the one that has a movement to it so we're going to add this one to it so here we have it here so all we have to do is to reduce this one like so and put it right here so just put it so that it doesn't block the right top okay Put it like so. So one more thing we can do to this to make it more visible is to come over here and add effects and then come over to this part and click on background. So now we have a background for it. Can even make it bold like this. So we have something like this and it's looking very pretty already. And then this one, because we have yellow here so that we don't have different colors. So this one, we can just change the color you can decide to change the color to yellow so we can harmonize the colors and make it look very appealing. So we're going to select yellow and now we have the same thing here. And from what I'm seeing here is looking amazing already. Trust me guys, by the time you watch this video to the end, your mind will be blown. Trust me on this. So please go ahead and like this video so that more people can see it and benefit from it. Go ahead, go ahead and like the video. Thank you for doing that, okay? Okay, I love you, I love you. <laughs> so now that I have the video 
you're ready, let's move over to the next phase, which is to bulk create the entire thing and create our 50 videos. Remember that the answer to the riddle is not yet here. And you really need to show people the answer to the riddle because most people might not get the answer. So you need to show them the answer. And that is part of the interaction. They're going to comment, oh, I missed it. Oh, I was close. Oh, I got the answer and stuff like that. And those are the things that grow your account. So I'm going to be showing you how to do that in this video so please stay with me don't go anywhere so the next thing we are going to do is to come over here and click on bulk crate so that we can upload the csv file that we downloaded so we're going to click on upload csv file and you can see it here you click on open and then you have it here and then the next thing you're going to do is to click on this text and then come over to this three dots here and click on connect data and click on it like this and you have it like so and then the next thing you're going to do is to click on continue click on continue like this and then you have everything like this and then you go ahead and click on generate 49 pages so now it's currently generating the 50 pages and it's going to be ready in one two three so now as you can see we have the complete 50 pages right here under two minutes guys under two minutes this is super fast but that's not the end because we are still going to add the answers as well but first let's download this because we are done with this already so all we are going to do is to click on share and then click on download and also here you can see save pages as separate files so the amazing canva team has added this to canva now you can download pages separately unlike the previous videos that i did where you cannot download the pages separately you have to download everything one after the other which takes time in downloading but now you can download everything separately at once how cool is that so all you have to do is to highlight this download pages as separate files and then click on download and it will download the entire 50 pages. How awesome is this? So while it's downloading, let's move over to the part two of this video. Don't forget that we still have the part three where we are going to piece everything together. I'm going to show you how to do that, put your sound and everything, and you're good to go. But for now, let's head over to the part two, and we're going to jump back to chat GPT. So here we are back on chat GPT. Hello, chat GPT. Can you please give us answers to these riddles and as you can see it has completed the answers to the riddles it gave us previously how awesome is this i'm going to show you guys what to do with it just hold on hold on hold that top hold that top all right so here i'm going to come over here and do the same thing i did to the previous one and that is highlight and copy to so come over to canva again but you can decide to maintain this same design or you can decide to change things up you know the answer up you can choose to change the color of the answer from black to somewhere gray like this or go to something greenish or come over to elements this time around let's search for answers and see if we can find something nice so this looks good but i don't know if it's going to fit into the orientation we have but let's just try it you can never tell so all we have to do is to drag and drop it here and it looks it looks totally off it's not good at all so what we can do in this case is to just get creative okay and then we'll bring in this as a normal video and we are going to put it here like this so now we have this what you can do to make it actually look good is to trim it down to fit into this and then you can also reduce the transparency so that it can blend in a little more if you don't like this you can change the background to whatever that suits your style i'm just using this so that i don't waste time searching through what will look good and all that so i'm just going to use this for the purpose of this tutorial and then the next thing we're going to do is to come over here, click on this, go to effect, click on effect, and then come over to the color and change it to green. So we have this, and then you come over to the color of the text, we change it to white. So we have something like this. It's looking amazing, but the green is not greening enough. <laughs> the green is not greening enough. That's in Nigerian English, if you don't understand it. So what we're going to do is to pick the color picker tool and we are going to pick the same color with this 
so that we can harmonize the colors. And then here you can choose to maintain this or you can just change it to another thing. So we'll come here and search for answers. You go to graphics and look for any animated answer kind of thing. And we have something like this. So, but you can take your time and find something that fits perfectly. Personally, I don't think I'm going to go with this originally, but for the purpose of this tutorial, I just want to show you what works so you can then let your creativity run wild, guys. Let your creativity run wild, right? So next thing we're going to do, since we have this ready, go over to Bulk Create again, click on it, and then we're going to click on Upload CSV File. So now, as you can see, it has generated the pages for us automatically. And the next thing we're going to do, my friends, is to click on Share and then click on Download. And remember, you can choose to download it in 4k or 1080p or even 720p depending on what you want to use it for but if you don't have enough space on your device you can use 720p is still okay the resolution will be very very crisp and okay so but i'm going to use 1080p for the purpose of this tutorial and again we're going to highlight these download pages as separate files and click on download so we have the questions and the answers ready in separate folders and then we'll come over to the part three of this video so before i go over to the part three i know a lot of people might find it difficult to do some of these things so if you're having any difficulties in understanding some of these things or implementing some of these things or if you're having challenges or you're overwhelmed by too much information and you really want to make money online but you don't know where to start or how to start please find the link in the description to book a one-on-one -on -one zoom call with me so that i can give you clarity and together we're going to find the best way for you to make money online and then i get to teach you some of these things one-on-one -on -one. so go ahead and click the link in the description to book the session today so now that i've gotten that out of the way let's move over to the part three of this video but please permit me to wear my headphones because we're going to be playing some sounds, right? So we're going to be moving over to CapCut. The reason why we're using CapCut is because we're going to be working with a lot of videos and you don't want to dump a lot of video in your Canva. It will take a lot of uploading and downloading. So you don't want to flood your Canva account with too many videos. So we're going to be doing this with CapCut. So I'm going to quickly show you how to do it and you will understand it trust me it's very easy so let's move over to CapCut. so this is my CapCut desktop and it's the same thing if you're using mobile the same procedure the same process to achieve the same thing so all we're going to do here is to come over here and pick the question we are going to pick one of the question that's number one of the question and we're going to drop it to our timeline and then we're going to come over to the folder again and we're going to open the answers and also pick number one answer okay number one and we're going to drop it to our timeline as well so now we have one question and one answer number one question and number one answer in our timeline so i'm going to drag this to this point and we're going to have something like this. That's not all, guys. That's not all. We're going to make this very interactive, as interactive as possible. While it plays and it gets to the point where the question stops, just give a few seconds and then stop it there. So we're going to cut it over here. So I'm going to trim this down to this point so that it just gives a few seconds and then the answer enters. So we're going to play it through and see how it looks. And then this is the answer. Amazing, right? So because the answer is quite short, let's bring this way down to this point okay so we have the questions and then the answer will enter okay so that we can have over 100 percent retention rate so you want it immediately the answer comes it goes off immediately so that someone that doesn't catch the answer will want to play it over again you get the point you get the point right <laughs> all right so i'm going to trim it a little more to this point so that once the answer just flashes it goes off so that will prompt the person to want to watch it again to get the answer okay so yeah yeah just like that so it's going to repeat immediately so the person might want to watch again so we are going to be getting 200 percent retention rate guys this is how to blow up your youtube channel guys this is just how to blow up your youtube channel you have to like this video if you haven't liked this video yet go ahead and like the video and you can also go ahead and subscribe to this channel for more awesome videos like this in case you want to see awesome videos like this because i won't get tired of making awesome videos for you
okay? All right, so the next thing we're going to do is to move over to the sound design and we're going to go over to YouTube. I don't like using any other music except from YouTube music. So we're going to be going over to YouTube music library to download our song that we're going to be using for this. We're going to be using a special kind of sound that will add to the interaction. Trust me guys, you're going to love this. So come over to your YouTube studio and then click on audio library. And then in the audio library, you're going to search for suspense. So we're going to just go ahead and download this one straight up. This is totally safe to do. YouTube gives you the 100% right to download this song and use it in your videos as long as you're going to be uploading it on YouTube and then give attribution to where attribution is required and you're good to go. So please make sure you use this wisely, okay? One of the reasons why I love using YouTube sounds on YouTube is so that I don't get mixed up with all those copyright claims and all that. I don't really want to get involved with all that. So all we are going to do right now is to bring in this music that we downloaded. So we're going to go to download and drag and drop like so. So now we have this, we can add a little sound effect to this and we're going to come over to audio here in CapCut and search for cheers, okay? Search for cheers. So now we have this and we're going to go with this and we're just going to put it just right here, okay? Where the answer comes in. All right, so this is perfect. And we're going to go ahead and trim it down, way down. And we're going to reduce the sound very well to this level. And then the next step you're going to take is simply to come over to export Click on export and put in middle one and then select folder and click on export and you have your video exported and ready to be uploaded on all platforms, especially on YouTube shorts. Do this over and over again. Have at least one video or two videos uploaded on each of the platform, YouTube, Instagram and TikTok every day. Do this for 30 days without breaking it and let me know the result in the comment section or you can shoot me a DM on Instagram and let me know your result. I'm talking about results. If you have been online for a while and you're finding it difficult to make money, that means you're missing something. And I've done a video in that regard to teach you why you are not making money online and I will recommend that you go watch the video right here. Click on it right now to watch it so that you can learn how you can start making money online right away. Go ahead and click on this video, watch it, and thank me later. See you on the other side.